Hello, my journey family. Thanks for tuning in. Today, I will be doing a story time about when I had my first child. And I'm going to do a sunflower seed mukbang. Okay? So, I want you guys to hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Leave a comment below of how you liked the intro and what comments you have about this video. And also... Don't forget to hit the like button. Thank you. Let's just get right into this story time. Thanks for watching, Journey Family. And those of you that are new, please subscribe. And I love all of you. You're very important to me. So let's get right in here and just pop these right open. Of course, this is like 30 bags of sunflower seeds. I'm not going to open all of them. Pour them right into the bowl. Okay, you guys, let me get started. So, oh, I forgot about the Snapple. I forgot the Snapple. I have Kiwi Strawberry Snapple. It's very good. Got it from our local grocery store. So, when I was, well, I'm going to tell you about this. The only symptoms that I had when I was pregnant with my son, and please let me remind you, I didn't even know I was pregnant. But the sim one symptom that I had was I threw up at work. I thought it was something that I ate. Okay? Didn't know about pregnancy or nothing like that. Didn't even know I was pregnant. Okay, I was pregnant with my son for... Only five months. So at this time, I went to the doctor and I um, was four, four and a half weeks pregnant. So when I reached my five month period, I had him. Okay? He was only one pound, 14 ounces. Okay, I was at my grandmother's house. She's deceased now. And she was making Thanksgiving dinner for the next day. He was born on Thanksgiving. And I woke up, no, um, that night I ate cereal or something I ate, can't remember. Went and I laid down to go to sleep, woke up at, in the morning. And I, um, um, I was... I think I was bleeding or something like that. And I ended up going to the hospital. And when I got to the hospital, this is at five months. Only knew four and a half months. Had them the next week, which made it me, a week and a half, which made me five months. I went to the hospital on Thanksgiving morning. Had him that morning when he was born. He was about this little. And let me let me just let y'all know this. Me, myself, I was only 15 ounces when I was a baby. So, all right. So I had him. He stayed at the NICU. All together, about nine months. He had about... 15, 16 surgeries out of his lifetime. His last surgery was about three, four years ago, his gallbladder. So, I want to talk about the experience. His feet were this little. He had tubes up his nose. He had IVs in his forehead, in his neck, in his ankle. He had um, tubes to drain the fluid. Um, he has marks under his arm, by his chest, by his stomach. Different tubes they put in there to drain the fluid. He had to flip them from one side to the next. And they gave him medicine. The more fluid he lost, the more they put it into him. And this experience in the NICU was very, very different for me. I had literally had to live in the hospital. And... When he finally got out of the hospital, got, finally got discharged, he was out for maybe two or three weeks. 
and they went right back into the hospital. So he had to stay there a little bit longer. He came home on heart monitors, oxygen, and you guys would not believe that I had to do CPR on my son five or six times to bring him back to life. I literally watched him just stop breathing. His tongue come out of his mouth and I had to breathe into him and do finger press. Okay, the CPR, and then he came back to life. That was like six times. So that experience to me as a mother was really, really um, life-changing. It's something that I can tell people. Um, and also when I was pregnant, I had I have three children. So I have no pain with neither one of my children. No, all the stories people have about, oh, my son was hurt and I had cravings. Um, it hurt it when I pushed him out. I had to get medicine. I didn't have to get anything. It was nothing wrong. Nothing. It was just smooth. All three children. All three. I have three children. My son is 20 now. My other daughter is 18 and the other one is 14. Okay. And I had no problems with none of them. But that doesn't, I don't want to tell you all that. Just that, oh, I'm going to have a baby. It's going to be smooth. No, I'm not saying that. Everybody is different. But, I have not experienced any pain. But my son now has developed into this mature, um, uh, just a gentleman. He loves his family. He loves his mom. He loves his sisters. <coughs> he loves his stepdad. He absolutely loves God. And, let me tell y'all something else. He's going to see this video. And he better not comment, but he can comment. He's also a virgin. I said, your body is a temple, and your body is important just as well as a female's body. Keep your goods to yourself until you find the right one. So, I can't see how many minutes I am in this video. Can you come check and see how many minutes I am into this video? Okay. Let me just check and see, because I don't want the video to be too long, the story time. But, you got Seven. Seven minutes. Okay. So... These sunflower seeds, you know, 30 bags. I love sunflower seeds. Comment below if you love sunflower seeds and what kind you like. I only like the Davis original, okay? Only kind I eat good. They're jumbo. Awesome. So I got my bowl filled up, and I'm going to get my life tonight and eat these sunflower seeds and have fun. So I want to say to all of you guys, mm. Mm -mm -mm. You're good. I want to say to all of my subscribers again and again and again, thank you for subscribing. Keep your notification button on. Every time I upload, you will get it. And I want you to watch the videos, comment, go back into my videos. I've been on YouTube for two years. Watch my videos, comment on them, and I will make sure I put a heart by your comment. And if I feel like you need a, a comment back, I will. And also, to um, make sure that you hit the like button and tell everyone you know, how about watching 1024 Journey? I'm in the Journey family, and I want you to join. So, let's help each other go up. I thank you all for watching in this story time. And I will get back to you guys on tomorrow with a whole nother video. Leave your comments. Love you guys. Peace.